calm. We must be calm. for you, ma'am. Edward, what a pleasure to see you. Mrs. Dashwood. Miss Marianne. Margaret. Miss Dashwood. I trust I find you all well. Thank you, Edward. We are all very well. We have been enjoying very fine weather. Well, we have. Well, I I'm glad to hear it. The roads were very uh, dry. May I wish you great joy, Edward? You have left Mrs. Fair as well. It, tolerably. Thank you. Is I... Mrs. Ferris of the new parish? No, no. No, my, my, my mother is in town. I meant to inquire after Mrs. Edward Ferris. Well, then you, you have not heard. You, I think, I think you, you, you mean my brother. You mean Miss, Mrs. Robert Ferris. Mrs. Robert Ferris. Yes. I um. I, re I received a, a letter from Miss Steele, Mrs. Ferris. I, I should say. Um. Uh, Communicating to me the, um, the, the the transfer of her affections to my brother Robert. Um, it, it seems they were much thrown together in in London, and um, in view of, of, of the change in my circumstances, I, I felt it um, only right that she be released from our engagement. Uh, at any rate, they were married uh, last week and are now in Plymouth. Then you are not married. No. I met Lucy when I was very young. <laughs> had I had an active profession, I should never have felt such an idle, a foolish inclination. My behavior at Norland was very wrong. But I convinced myself that you felt any friendship for me, and that it was my heart alone that I was risking. I, I've come here with no expectations, only to profess now that I am at liberty to do so that my heart is and always will be yours. He's sitting next to her. Oh, 
Margaret, come down. Will you stop that? What else? What else? Oh, Marianne. Tell us. Margaret. Margaret. Wait. He's kneeling down. 